today I am on a mission to compare a one dollar buffet here in Manila against a one hundred dollar buffet can you actually believe it so it's gonna be a fun video full of interesting food so let's go out there and let's see what we can eat let's go look at this there's a huge selection of everything there is uh, some sort of pasta with cheese oh, this smells really good what's this one Soup. Do you have pan said palamo? Yeah. You have? No. Palana, meronta. Pan said? This one. What's this one? The other one. Oh, Is that chicken? The other one. I know. <laughs> <laughs> chaos. Absolute chaos. I have no idea what's going on. Is it chicken? The other one. Chicken? This one. chicken. 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 Okay. Uh, can I have a half plate of chicken? No. I want to try maybe two, three different plates. Manok, manok, yeah, yeah, manok. I, I can ask that word. Yeah, yeah, check it. Yeah, 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 manok. <laughs> can you give me half plate? Because I want to try maybe three different plates. I want to try everything. <laughs> yeah, 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 exactly, exactly. Yeah. No idea what she said. <laughs> Alright, what's going on? So, I have no idea who's being served. So, it looks like there's people all around here and here. Am I next in line? Am I next in line? I don't know either. I don't think anyone knows. Alright, so how does this work? One manok. One manok. One manok. Yeah, yeah, give me half, give me half. Uh, I try half, then I'll try half, that half and half, okay? All half? Yeah, yeah, I want to try one, then another one, then another one, then another one. Yeah, so give me half. Yeah. Only a little bit, yeah? Oh, oh, hello. Oh, you got a beauty filter on. Oh, beauty, look at this. I look like I'm about five years old. One more. One more. Oh, Maganda, Maganda. Maganda, <laughs> This is my one. It's chicken. Chicken. No, no pork, just chicken. Just chicken. Yeah, yeah, just chicken. I love that haram pork for me. <laughs> chicken? Yes. Okay, where can I sit? Where can I sit? Sit. Sit. Yeah. Here. Oh, yeah? I sit down on your lap. <laughs> Alright, let's see. I'll, I'll, I'll sit down on the floor, yeah? Okay, let's see. So, I guess we'll just have. Here? Yeah? Where, where, where? Is there a chair? Man, this is madness. Absolute madness. Wait, uh, wait. Are you going to get me a chair? Yeah, I think uh, you can take this place. Uh, thank you so much, sir. You're, You're very kind. Thank you so much. Salamat. Salamat po. Wow, what kind man? Thank you, sir. It's, Salamat. It's welcome. Along Panganang mo? My name is Kael po. Kael. Kael. Thank you so much. You're a gentleman. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you so much. You're welcome. All right. Uh, what, what's the name of this one? Sorry? This one. What's the name? That's Pansit Canton. Pansit? Pansit Canton. Canton. Okay. So, um, I, I, I don't think it's um, it's not a Filipino food, but uh -huh. it's from um, Chinese, a, a Chinese food. Chinese fusion. Yes, but um, here we adopt it. And, we cook in the Filipino way. With coke? We cook. We cook. Oh, oh, oh. We cook it. I thought you said with coke. No. <laughs> we it give looks really um, good. another version of Pancit Canton. Okay. It looks really good. Muscle wrap? Try it. Muscle wrap? Okay. Try it. Try All right. It. I'll be the judge of that. Let's see. So, as you can see, it's a bunch of noodles. We've got some soy sauce, I think, on it. There's bits of chicken. There's black pepper. I think there's cucumber as well. There's literally every single thing in there. So let's go ahead and give it a try. Let's get a big spoonful. I only wanted a half because I actually want to go ahead and try a little bit of everything. There's like, uh, as you saw, there's like uh, pasta. There's some, uh, I don't know what these are, calamansi, I think. There's some eggs, there's some more noodles. So we'll go ahead and try a little bit of everything. But next time, hopefully, the other portion is a little bit smaller than this because after this, guys, we're actually going to go ahead to the spiral buffet and we'll try the $100 buffet. So it's going to be a lot of food today. Anyway, enough of me talking. Let's go ahead and give this a try. Pass up. 
It's really good. Hello, my YouTube channel. Is your YouTube channel again? Go with Ali. Yeah, go with Ali. Go with Ali. Yeah. It's really good, man. So I had this about a year ago. I don't think it was this specific one, but uh, I've eaten in this place before, as I told you. And honestly, it's as delicious as I remember. And just over here, we have uh, some calamansi as well. It's kind of like the uh, Filipino version of the lime. It's not quite a lime. It's not quite an orange. I guess it's somewhere, somewhere in between. Ah, oh, smells so nice. Mm. It's like a, a sweet lime. It's not a, it's not the lime that you used to back in the UK. Anyway, let's go ahead and let's get a big fork full again. Mm. That is much much better. With that kind of mass, you just kind of touch through all of those fats, all of those oils. Mm. There you go. Let's get. It's, it's muscle wrap. Masarap. Masarap. Yeah. It's really good, really good. You like? No. Oh, you don't like? <laughs> from where are you? Uh, I'm from London. I'm London. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, are you from Manila? Yeah, Philippines. Oh, nice, nice. Which, uh, which area? Here, in Kiapo. In Kiapo? Yes. Born and bred in Kiapo? Kiapo. No, you born in Kiapo? Yes. Nice. This is your second time vlogging. Uh, second time vlogging this place, yeah. It's really good. By the way, what's your name? Uh, Ali. Ali. Go with Ali. Uh, what's your name? Along Panganamo? Me? Yes, Evelyn. Evelyn? Yeah. Nice to meet you, Evelyn. Really nice to meet you. Hi. <laughs> Hello. Hello. <laughs> Is, that, uh, is it working? It's working, yeah, yeah. You're it's live. On? Yeah, yeah, it's on. So I'm live. Hello. <laughs> I'm Nana Evelyn. <laughs> Maganda Evelyn. Black beauty. Black, oh, yeah, black. Exactly. Melanin. Alhamdulillah. 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 Salam alaikum. Wa alaikum salam. Alaikum salam. Wow, so you speak Arabic better than me. Speak Arabic. Yeah. Your Arabic is very good. It's better than mine. Quite? Quite, yes. I'm quite, yeah. I was a bit. MashaAllah, nice to meet you, Evelyn. Really nice to meet you. We try this. I recommend this to you. Yeah, I will try that one next and maybe one more. And then and the dessert. dessert. Exactly. Yeah, dessert. I'm going to lose all my abs today. <laughs> all right, guys. And there you go. I was not kidding when I told you this thing was delicious. A couple of minutes later, and it is completely finished. So let's go ahead and uh, I guess let's try some more food. Okay, I want some more. <laughs> which one uh, Which one did the lady recommend? This one with sabao? But can you give me less? Because I want to try everything. Uh, give me like quarter plate. <laughs> Much less. Yeah, that's it, that's enough. That is the famous here in I'm not sure if that one is mine. Yeah, that's enough. That's enough. And a little bit of soup. Perfect. That's it. That will do. Uh, what's the name of this one? Sultan. Sultan. Sultan Man Soup. Okay. Salamat. Sultan. 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 So, so time hot. That's hard to say. <laughs> oh, that was the famous dish here in Kiapo. Oh, this is the famous one. Oh, wow. Okay. So, this is what they're known for. Amazing. There you go. So, as you can see. Really? Okay. So, I guess I'll be back next year again. <laughs> Let's give this a try. Oh, shit. This is good. Oh, man. This is actually really good. As good as that noodle was at the start, I think this one's even better. So I think the move is also to get a little bit of uh, that calamansi. I feel like calamansi goes with everything. Um, it's like I'm literally just looking at everyone and that, that is literally what they do. They just get a little bit of calamansi, and squeeze it literally over everything. And again, it's just um, nicely cuts through all the fat and it cuts through all of uh, those juices as well. Uh, it's so much better than that, man. Even better, I took it up one notch up. Mm. There you go, completely demolished. So, that's two plates down. I think it's now probably time for a little bit of dessert. 
and maybe some juice and then afterwards we'll go head out to the other buffet delicious can I have one pineapple and uh, two dessert can you give me uh, two different desserts the best ones yeah beautiful looking ananas juice nice and cold let's put that over here while we get our desserts as well. Oh, look at this. Okay. So Artic, uh, can you give me a different one? Different one. Yeah, different one. Two different ones. Two kids. Only two kids. More miscommunication. <laughs> Okay, here we go. Okay, salamat. Salamat. All right, so let's put that over here. All right, let's see what we got. So I have no idea what we got. Uh, I think this is ube. Is this ube? Oh, this is so nice and dense. Guys, honestly, this weighs about a quarter of a kilo just that in itself. And uh, I'm not sure what this is. Some nice caramelly looking thing. Nice and sweet. Anyway, let's go ahead and start with that pineapple juice. I think that's probably the best place to start. Uh, just to wash off all of those spices and then that way we get to taste those uh, desserts properly Ah oh, man, that is some good ananas juice, nice and cold, refreshing As you can see, it's literally just sitting there in all of that ice But I think now, it's time to go ahead and try this thing Honestly, I have no idea what this is It looks pretty good I think it's some sort of rice at the bottom, some sort of caramel. Mm. What is this? Mm, good. This is good. Wow. Uh, what's the name of this one? Uh, Biko. Biko? Rice cake. Rice cake. Wow, okay. This is delicious, man. It's got some uh, nice caramel taste to it. And I think it's exactly as what we thought. There's definitely rice underneath this. Mm. That's good. Oh, sorry. I just realized there's an old lady standing here. Okay, I'll take You can sit down. It's okay. I can sit down on the step. No problem. Let me sit down here. All right. That's better. There you go. So let's go ahead and let's finish this thing off as well. I think you get a better look over here as well. Whatever that thing on the top is, man, it is delicious. That bottom bit literally just soaked all of those juices, all of that sugar. But the top bit is where it's really at, man. It tastes like a caramel. Yummy! Mm. It's so good. It smells so rough. Smells so rough. Oh, this is so delicious. And uh, let's go ahead and try this thing. Man, this genuinely weighs like a quarter of a kilo. This is so dense. I don't know, this is probably a thousand calories just from this little thing over here. Mm. Excuse me. Oh, sorry, sir. Sorry. I'm blocking everyone's way. <laughs> so, whatever that thing was over there. I told you there's like a layer on top of that rice. I think this is the layer that was on top of the rice. But look at this, it is so dense, man. Genuinely, this is probably about a thousand calories right here. Okay, Ate. I am fat. I am very full. <laughs> uh, Makano? Makano, Makano. <laughs> no idea what she said. 90. 90 pesos for all of that food. But I have two plates, juice, and two dessert for 90 pesos. Wow, that is amazing. So 90 pesos is about, I don't know, it's like $2 or something for all of that food. That's very good, very good. Uh, Mabutu. Okay, Ate. Uh, this is for you, no change. No change. No, no, it's for you. Okay? No, no change. Huh? No change. Why? No kiss. <laughs> no kiss or no kiss? <laughs> yeah, keep the change. Keep the change. Oh. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> kiss, change. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> okay, salamat, Ate.
Thank you. Thank you, Sana. I will come back again. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay. Ingat. Ingat. Take care. Wow, man. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Come back. Come back. Bye bye. Bye bye. Anna Piro? Yeah, Anna. She is the owner. She is the owner of yeah. this place. This one. Oh, okay. She's my best friend. Ah, oh, how did you meet her? How did you take selfie? Uh, 20 years ago. 20 years ago, wow. We're still best uh, friends. Long time, yeah? Yeah, long time. it's a long time. Maybe I will come back every year and I will see you every year as well. Okay. Okay, Evelyn, right? Uh, uh, your name? Evelyn. Evelyn, that's oh, the one. No, Evelyn, I thought it was every Evelyn. Yes. Okay, Arte, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Have you have a good day, yeah? Uh, Salamat. Bye bye. 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 Bye Hello, Hello. 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 Oh, good, good, good. Okay, nice. Okay, let's do it, let's do it. It's very famous, huh? Libre, libre. Yeah, Maganda, Maganda. Quiet. Quiet, quiet. Okay, salamat po, salamat. Ah, London? Yeah. Country London? Salamat, yeah. Ingat, ingat. Yes. Wow. Thank oh, sorry. You. Okay, thank you, thank you. All right, so that was a delicious first stop. To be honest with you, I have no idea how the spiral buffet is going to beat this. I mean, in terms of food, it was really good. In terms of atmospheres, it's amazing. I've been there before once, and uh, now you saw why I went back in there again, man. It is a delicious place, really, really nice people. But anyway, let's walk off for about I don't know, I think it's probably going to take us about an hour to get over there which is probably just enough time to digest all of that food and we make it all the way to the spiral buffet, so let's go I'm still here, I haven't moved a single inch <laughs> no, this, is, this is how we're walking here Thank you sir, Salamat po Do you boy sir? Hello po, how are you? You good? I'm good, sir. How about you, sir? I'm very good. Very How's good. How's your trip? Uh, very good. Have I'm a nice day, to, sir. Uh, uh, I'm here for the Spiral Buffet. Spiral Buffet. Let me assist you inside, yes, sir. Okay. Are you vlogging, sir? I am, yes. Yo, Sap. Welcome to Sob Italia. <laughs> two joints? Two joints? Two joints. Come <laughs> here, sir. Alright, so here we are, guys. So we just arrived at the second location. And uh, I believe this is uh, the Spiral Buffet? Yes, Spiral, spiral buffet, buffet, sir. Why is it called Spiral? Because you're gonna see a spire, uh, I don't know also, sir, sorry. Okay. <laughs> oh, because of the spiral case? Yeah. Okay. All right, let's see. Hi. Say spire, sir. Oh, this is um, the yes, spiral sir. case? Have a nice day. Oh, that one there. Thank Amazing. you. Thank you. So this is not the spiral case. That one there is the spiral case. And look at that. That is an amazing looking spiral case. Wow. I mean, to be honest with you, if I had a spiral case like that, I would probably name my daughter a spiral as well. Now that I have a daughter. Now that I know of anyway. Hello, how are you? I'm good. Uh, I'm here for the spiral buffet. Yes, sir. Do you have reservation? I have a reservation, but I just got an email to say that it's been cancelled. Uh, already lapsed. Yeah. Um, because we have 15 minutes holding period, that's why. Yeah. I, I don't I don't need three hours to eat, it's fine. This one is for how many persons, sir? Okay. Under what name, sir? Uh, Ali. A-L-I. A-L? I. I. Yeah. Do you have a table? Yes, sir. Okay, that's good, that's good. I thought my place was cancelled, but... Oh my god, look at this. There are people cooking over there, you've got fresh food, you got some things getting steamed over there as well. And you got a uh, band playing, some juice places. And literally everyone just sitting there eating. It's a Sunday. I believe this is the best day to come. Is Sunday the best day to come? For me, yes. Because we have big clothing of champagne and some other um, drinks. Wow, amazing. amazing. And the food, the food, sir, it's upgraded, sir. For seafood. Yeah. For okay. Uh, I think I'm going to get very fat. I'm going to become very fat today. <laughs> it's okay. Yeah. It's, cheap. it's your cheat day. It's, my, it's, it's been a cheat week. Yes. Cheat week? <laughs> oh, yes. Uh, how's someone to ask you? Salamat. Salamat. Really? 
Wow. First time at Spiral? First it's my first time. time, yeah, yeah. Okay. I will call Janine to assess you, Mr. Ali. Salamat. I'll give you a bigger table, okay? Oh, yeah? Okay. Um, Things are definitely looking up for Uncle Ali. We've got a bigger table. This is good. Can I get some of the spicy shrimp? Yes, please, sir. Uh, just a little bit, yeah? Yes, uh, sir. Less, less. Yeah, yeah. I just wanted to taste it. Salamat, for Salamat. I think that is the way to go, guys. Just you just get a little bit of everything. That way you get to taste everything. And then that way, if you also like something, you can always just come back to it. There's no point of just filling your plate. As you saw, we're going to have literally about three hours worth of eating over here. And uh, I'm looking forward to this, man. What do we have over here? So this is... This, this is noodle? Noodle? Pad Thai. Pad Thai. Okay. Can I have a little bit of Pad Thai? Can uh, I uh, put it in a separate bowl since I'll put some... Garnish. Ah, okay. Um, uh, just a noodle, because I have a shrimp already. And just a uh, malit. Just a tiny bit. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, perfect. And half of that, half. I will be back later for more. <laughs> Amazing. Yeah, so you keep this bit and I'll take this bit. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> Perfect. Salamat po. Salamat. Wow. Smells good, man. So obviously we are getting started with, uh, with the Thai food. She said this is one of the highlights they do over here. One of the main Asian cuisines. What do we have over here? Crispy fried fish and Maya Maya with chili. Oh. Can I have a couple of pieces? Uh, a few pieces? Amazing. Thank you. Thank you Salamat. Man. Salamat. And over here we have uh, lobster claws and uh, we have some butter chili prawns as well. Oh my god. Oh, look at this. This. Uh, kind of like a chow kind of thing but I reckon we're gonna have to try some of those prawns as well I believe uh, my host recommended this so we're gonna get some hello how are you uh, can I have uh, two shrimps Wow! amazing salamat salamat everyone's really nice here as well man really nice and hospitable so great start so far I can uh, I'm gonna go ahead and put my plate down and uh, I guess we can get started with this. This is the Thai section of the food. All right, let's see. Yeah. Let's go ahead and let's get started on the first round, which is of course the, uh, the Thai section. Oh, thank you, Salamat. It's because this side is better. It's more beautiful. <laughs> Salamat. No champagne. Uh, no champagne. No champagne. Thank you. Yes, please. Salamat. No champagne for me, guys. Haram. So uh, let's go get started on this. Mm. First couple of bites, I didn't feel the spice, but now you can probably even see it. My face is starting to go red. I can feel it. Mm. It's probably a good idea to go ahead and wash out some of that spicy taste with some of this amazing looking pad thai as well. So pad thai. It's really hard to get right, honestly. I've only ever had a good Pad Thai in Thailand. I've had it a couple of times in, uh, in the UK and every single time I was disappointed. So hopefully this is good and hopefully this is authentic. Mm. It's good, it's nice and sweet. Uh, a little bit dry if I'm honest. I guess it's because um, it was just sitting on the pan. Uh, maybe if you came there when they just started to cook it, it would have been a lot more fresh. Here we go, we've got the mango juice over here. Hopefully you'll wash out some of that spicy flavor. Ah, oh, that's good, man. Damn, that is so good. I think this is freshly squeezed. 
you can see it's nice and thick. It's none of that, um, those things that you get in cartons like a Tropicana or anything. Ah, I think it's time to finally stop looking at the shrimp and it's time to go ahead and taste it. So let me sit you guys down on this uh, table because I think this is a two hand job. <laughs> How do you do this thing? Here we go. Nice bit of uh, corn. Look at this. How meaty is this? That is a good prawn, man. That is so nice and fresh, succulent, cooked to perfection. Here we are. Another nice little bit of uh, shrimp as well. Let's give this a try. As good as the first one. First round is completely demolished. So let's go ahead and let's get some more. The last time we ended somewhere over there. Look. <laughs> wow, you're very tall. Very tall. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> Whoa. That's a good vantage point. From there, you can literally see all the good food. Oh, look at this. So, uh, we've got sesame balls of some sort. This is looking interesting. I've never had sesame balls before. I reckon we're going to have to go ahead and try some of that sesame roll. Hello, um, can I get one sesame roll? Thank you, Salama. Alright, uh, this is not going to be the whole round guys, don't worry, we're going to get some more food. So we have uh, chicken feet, we have, look at this. So this is, I can't remember what she called, Shai Shamai? What, what is this called? What's the name? Uh, do you have? Scallop bow, pork, and this one is scallop and parsley. Okay, do you have chicken? Chicken, we don't have chicken right now. Oh, seafood? Seafood, yeah. Okay, can I have seafood? This one, scallop and parsley. Uh, yes, please. Yes, one, two. Uh, maybe two. Salamat. Uh, that's it, that'll do. So let's see what else we can get over here. So we have the beef brisket noodle, spicy laksa noodle soup. We have chicken noodle, and I think that's tofu at the back as well. Yeah, it looks like some sort of tofu. And we have roasted duck, roasted chicken, and honey roasted pork. And oh my God, look at this. Whoa. Can I get some roasted duck? Yes, please. Uh, just a little bit, please, yeah? Amazing, that will do. Uh, yes, please. Yeah, which sauce is this one? Hoisin sauce. You see? Hoisin sauce. I'll say. Hoisin sauce. Amazing. Salamat for Salamat. All right, guys, I think I figured out the way uh, of how we can actually go ahead and beat this buffet. So, obviously, this buffet costs about, uh, I think, $100. So, I think if you keep getting up and keep getting back down, um, you're going to get full very quickly. So, I think what we're going to go ahead and do take this plate put it on my table and then come back and just pile on the plates that way we can get three four plates in one go and then hopefully we get a lot more food down us so let's put that over here and let's go ahead and uh, maybe get some high ticket items i saw some uh, some oysters over there so i think that would be a good shout i'm getting full already <laughs> it's only round one <laughs> don't worry guys don't worry we're gonna beat this buffet there's no way I'm getting out of here without getting a hundred dollars worth of food. So let's go ahead and let's get some oysters. Fresh, fresh oysters. To be honest with you, I think I've had fresh oysters probably... I think if I did have it, it probably once in my life, if that. Look at that. Fresh oysters on a bit of uh, seaweed. We've got ice underneath it as well. And uh, we've got more over here as well. Can I get three pieces? Yes, please. This is good. This is muscle wrap. I think this is my first. Uh, just the, just the, uh, just the, yeah, yeah. I just wanted to taste. Yes, please. So, a little bit of lemon as well. Amazing. Salamat, salamat. All right, there you go. So, this is the second plate. I think we'll go ahead and eat all of this and maybe come back for the lobster. Guys, this is the only way to get your money's worth. Uh, this buffet you have to go for the expensive seafood round two is in front of us so obviously we went for the duck with the hoisin sauce i think she said uh, some sort of seafood here as well 
and the sesame ball. Let's get some of that lemon on top of that oyster. Really, really fill it up. Hopefully that kills any of that uh, fishy taste. And let's go ahead and give it a try. Wow. That's a mouthful and a half, man. Yeah, I don't think I've ever had oysters before in my life. And uh, I like it, to be honest. It's a lot less chewy than I was expecting. Like, um, let's get the seed out of the way. Like, um, you looking at this, think that it's going to be all muscle or at least hard to chew through. But honestly, it's like a, it's like a couple of bites and it's completely down. Let's get ahead and give this one a try as well. Let's go ahead and try this as well. So we got the uh, sesame ball over here. Let's dip that in the sauce. This is a one biter. Mm. Mm. Nice and zesty. Got a little bit of a kick from that chili as well. Let me go ahead and open this one. I think it's a piece of uh, shrimp. Yeah, it's a piece of shrimp. Not sure. I think the idea is you basically just drown it in that sauce and that way it picks up whatever flavor you have in front of you mm -hmm. much better this way here we go guys that second round is completely demolished and i think we need to go for more high ticket items that way we really go ahead and beat the buffet but something which i want you to notice is even though we are leaving the plates over here the staff are really good so they will literally just come take the plates away and that way by the time you come back there's space for more food so let's go ahead and let's get some more food whoa you got uh, clams over there mussels hello how are you uh, which one is your recommendation which one is good lobster lobster and burrata uh, can i have half a lobster just a small piece oh you're getting the best one for me yeah <laughs> amazing salamat Oh uh, no no just this yes, one. No, no. Just this one. How about uh some sauce? We have butter garlic. Uh, your recommendation. A butter garlic one. Let's do it. Is it okay if I'll just pour it here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Amazing. So there you go, we're gonna get some butter garlic on top of as well. I can feel my abs disappearing already. Enjoy <laughs> sir. Salamat. Salamat. Alright, let's go ahead. And let's put this back and i think we need to come back and probably get some of that indian food that cheese burrata was looking mighty delicious all right cheese burrata time indian food there you go there's the indian flag and this is looking bahut acha we got paneer we got biryani we got also the chicken as well all right so i can we're gonna get a little bit of cheese burrata, maybe a little bit of paneer, and a little bit of chicken as well. That way we get to taste a little bit of everything and maybe try some of these beautiful food. Hello, how are you? Uh, can I get some chicken and paneer as well? Oh, yes. butter, chicken and paneer. Yes, please. Uh, just a little bit. Yes, wow, look at that. This is about the chicken. Anything else you like to try, sir? Uh, can I try some of your biryani? and uh, cheese burrata cheese burrata you like chicken with biryani yes please yeah yeah let's try i want to try the best ones <laughs> well they all look really good and here we go the cheese burrata oh long hands yeah long hands. <laughs> daddy long arms <laughs> amazing salamat salamat po whoa this is looking mighty fine it smells good as well so this is is this our third round i think this is our third round but i think i'm only about i don't know 10 percent through the uh the buffet guys there's like cheese there's a french station there's literally every single thing and the desserts as well and let me show you as i was telling you before there you go the plates have completely disappeared the staff are incredible over here man and every single time i go around pointing the cameras and everyone faces it's been really friendly as well so top points to them so let's go ahead and let's try this i can we'll go ahead and start with the uh, lobster 
that way uh, the spicy food doesn't have any effect so I can give you a real judgment of what this tastes like and it's not a biased opinion look at this man and you got the eggs on top of it you got all of that garlic sauce as well all that butter my god this is looking mighty fine this is the real ticket items that you want to be filling yourself up on oh, look at that that is a meaty looking lobster tail Whoa. That garlic sauce, oh my god, it just punches you right in the throat, man. It is so damn good. And uh, look at this. So, you get the head butter as well, and all of those eggs as well. Look at that. This is genuinely the best lobster I've ever had in my life. Now that I've had many lobsters in my life, I usually stay away from seafood and I usually don't go to these really really fancy places guys if you know me all I like is Jollibee and KFC so uh, this is a real treat for me as well it's really really good the lobster is completely down completely demolished now of course it's the Indian food time so let's go ahead and start with a cheese burrata Hopefully this is as good as the cheese burratas that Luke Dumont was having all the way back in Pakistan. I'm going to tell you if I agree with this or not. But I think we'll go ahead and dip it in to the sauce as well. Let's give this a try. That is so damn good man. I don't know if it's the burrata or if it's the sauce. It's probably the combination of the two. Wow, that is mighty fine well, let's get a little bit of that chicken oh, that is beautiful man let's give this a try as well <laughs> damn this is sublime I don't use that word very often wow this is probably the best thing I've tasted here so far. Wow, that chicken. Mm. It's, uh, it's a little bit spicy, you got peppery taste on it. It's a little bit lemony and zesty as well. And I think this is one of those food you just have to pick up by your hands. Obviously you got fork, a knife and a spoon, but to get the real taste of the food, you just have to pick it up with your hand. I know I am in a really expensive hotel and a really expensive buffet but you just have to eat it like you usually do man. Mm. Wow. Mm. damn that's some good chicken man so whoever is in charge of the indian station whoever's making the chicken really knows what they're doing man this is tasting so so good nice and authentic and i can we'll get some of that sauce that sauce was so good and there you go mix it up there you go a real mouthful and here we go the third round is completely finished and i can definitely feel all of those spices starting to build up on my face you can probably see my face is shining but guys that's not going to beat us we're going to go ahead and get some more food so let's go I'm getting tired, <laughs> but I'm going to get more. <laughs> Look at this beautiful looking food, man. So we have roasted chicken, we have boneless lamb, and we have a ribeye, and we have a baked salmon as well. This is looking mighty fun. Hello, sir. Hello, sir. How are you? Fine, sir. Uh, can I please get some of uh, your delicious looking ribeye and boneless lamb? Uh, and just one piece. I just wanted to try it. A bigger piece. <laughs> a bigger piece. Oh, bigger too, sir. Uh, yeah, yeah, that looks good. Uh, which one, which one, what the, what the uh, yeah, yeah, that one looks good. Give me the best piece. Amazing. If you want, we can uh, read, sir. Sorry? Read, read you, you can grill it as well? Yes, please. Let's do it. So, sir, how about sauce? Uh, what's the recommendation? How about red bean sauce? Uh, beef? Okay. Uh, yeah, let me try some of the cream, please. Yes. Truffle. Uh, maybe the white one is which one? Which one is the white one? Uh, lemon butter, sir. Lemon butter, okay. Yes, please. 
Salamat, Kuya. Salamat. Oh man, this is looking mighty fine. So the guy uh, cut it off the uh, the lamb, and he also grilled it for me, which is really nice of him. So let's go ahead. Let's put this on our table, and now I can we come back and get some more again. And just over here we have the shoe situation as well. Wow. We have octopus, we have squid, we have a tuna. Look at this, it looks like a rose. Hello, how are you? Uh, what do you want, sir? Can you give me your best pieces? Maybe three, four pieces? What do you want, sir? Assorted, do you want, sir? Assorted sashimi and assorted pasta. Yeah, can you give me the, the best four pieces of your recommendation? Aye, sir. Yes, please. This is looking mighty fine. So this one is Alifon. One of each. One of each, uh, one of each yeah. The best ones, yeah? Wow. That is looking mighty fine. So we got the crispy salmon, oburi salmon, soft shell maki, and we got the sauce as well. Wow. Oh wow, you're very generous. Thank you. My god, this is looking good. Salamat. Salamat kuya. Salamat. Oh my god. Look at this. How beautiful is this? And it literally took them about, I don't know, 10 seconds to assemble. Wow, I mean, guys, I am a huge fan of sushi. So I think this is probably going to be our best round. We got some amazing looking ribeye, grilled ribeye, some lamb, and we got my favorite thing in the world, which is sushi. Wow. I think this is our fourth round. Uh, honestly, I'm not sure. Every single time I come here, I uh, the plates just keep disappearing. My abs are definitely disappearing as well, but uh, I think we need to keep on going at this stage, man. So let's go ahead and try some of this. I believe this is the lamb. Let's get some of that sauce, coating all of it. And uh, yeah, as I was saying, that man was so nice as well. He just need put it on the grill for me as well, to make it that much nicer. Let's go ahead and give this a try. Wow. Oh my god. <laughs> wow. I am genuinely speechless of how good this is, man. Oh. And that is literally just. I can't even say full of the bone because there's literally no bone on it, man. But that sauce is so nice and creamy. I can literally just put a straw in this sauce and drink it, man. Wow, that is genuinely delicious. Let's go ahead and try some of that ribeye. Look at this. You've got beautiful grill marks on top of it as well. It feels a little bit tough, I have to be honest. But let's give this a try. This is pretty chewy, like that took some chewing, but what it lacks in succulency, it definitely makes up for in the uh, tasty department. Uh, let's go ahead and mix that up with some of the other sauce as well. This is, I can't remember what the sauce is. Wow, that sauce is so good as well. And now it's time to go ahead and attack some of that sushi. So, Let's go ahead and uh, let's pick up this piece. Oh no. <laughs> Guys, I am not used to eating in these kind of places, man. Let's give this a try as well. Mm. That's so nice and fresh. I think this one is uh, squid or octopus. Honestly, not sure. Really, really hard to tell what this is. I have no idea what this is to be honest with you. I think it's squid. I'm so chewing. Alright. If 
you come in for sushi, do not try whatever that thing was, for goodness sake. It is super hard to eat, man. Let's follow that up with some salmon. Mm. Salmon is good. That is nice and fresh. Look at this beautiful marbling on it as well. Nice and fatty. I think this is my fourth or fifth round. I think it's probably the fifth round. But I am definitely slowing down, man. I am really, really struggling to breathe right now. But I think we need to keep on going. We really need to get our money's worth out of it. So let's see what else we have. So I believe this is the French section. We have some sort of broccoli. We have uh, pasta. I did not know French people were known for the uh, for pizzas and pasta. So I don't know, I guess this is a mixture of uh, French food as well as uh, Italian section as well. And we have the handmade pasta over here. So I think we have to have some of that handmade pasta. I've never tried it before. So it's probably a good shout to go ahead and try some. Look at this. So I think they get the pasta and they literally just dip it inside of that cheese. Kind of similar to what they're doing over here. Hello, how are you? Um, can I get some of your handmade pasta? Mm -hmm. We've got kind of sauce. Uh, can, can you put it in this? Truffle. Truffle. Is that possible? Come back after 8 to 10 minutes. 8 to 10 minutes? Yeah. Okay, so while we wait for our pasta to go ahead and get cooked, I think we'll go ahead and get some cheese as well. Hello. My god, this is smelling funky. So by the looks of it, we have all types of different cheese. We've got some... Uh, some orange one, green one, purple one, yellow one. We got some uh, gourmet ambre. Okay. Switch cheese. Wow. Okay. Hello. How are you? Uh, can I get maybe like a selection of maybe five pieces of the best ones that you recommend? I, ha I know nothing about cheese, so I'll go by recommendation. <laughs> this one is Brie. Brie fresh, okay. French. On the these are all uh, French cheeses. Um, some are Italian cheeses. Italian, okay. Would you like some blue cheese? Uh, yes, please. Yeah, yeah. Let's try. I like blue cheese usually. Wow, incredible. And it's okay, I can have smaller pieces. Thank you so much. Maybe just one more. This one's a truffle. Okay, let's try it. Salamat. Thank you so much. Thank you. My God, this is smelling funky. So we got blue cheese, we got truffle, we got um, gruyere. I don't even know how you say that, but let's go ahead and let's put that over there. And then I guess we come back and uh, we get our fresh handmade pasta with that truffle sauce as well. This is looking good. But honestly, I think we are really, really slowing down. This is probably going to be our last round. Uh, for actually going ahead and maybe getting some desserts, maybe some halo halo, and uh, I don't know, some cakes as well. But in terms of savory food, guys, I am feeling it. This is my second buffet in one day. Let's put that over here and let's go ahead and get our food. Some of the risotto as well, just a little bit. It's the same plate. Little, little. Yeah, just to taste it. Amazing. That is a car bomb right there. <laughs> salamat, salamat, bro. Man, this is looking mighty fine, but as I was saying to that man, that is a carb, a fat bomb at the same time, man. Uh, this is definitely going to be our last round because combined with this, with the cheese that we already have on our table, guys, this is alone probably about, I don't know, six, seven hundred calories. So yeah, after that, it's definitely dessert time and I think I am beaten. So we have the truffle risotto, truffle handmade pasta. And look at that, real pieces of uh, truffle. And of course we have all of those French 
and Italian cheeses. I think we should go ahead and start with the cheese. So I believe this is the uh, truffle cheese she mentioned. Mm. Wow. That is so nice and creamy. Mm. It literally just coats your mouth with just fat, saltiness. That truffle taste as well, man. That is so, so good. And uh, this one, this is looking pretty funky. I'm not sure if this is like the really, really smelly uh, cheeses that I usually smell whenever I go past these uh, expensive cheese shops. But let's go ahead and give it a try. I'll give you my honest opinion. Wow. That is genuinely nice, man. This is probably even better than the truffle piece that I had earlier. That is so damn good, man. This would have been amazing with uh, maybe some sort of acidic food, maybe like grapes or maybe even like a tea. Just something to cut through all of those uh, fatty, fatty uh, cheese. I have no idea what this is. It's looking pretty funky. So the inside of it is like uh, really, really creamy. Look, it's kind of, look, it's tearing apart literally under its own weight. But uh, you have some sort of crust all the way around it. Look at that, it's literally just dripping. Oh, no, no, no. My God. Oh, oh man. No, that is not good. Oh. It's like a, it's like a woody, smoky sock. Let's be honest, it tastes like a sock. <laughs> whatever that one is do not try it the first the first two were really good and i guess finally we'll go ahead and get some blue cheese blue cheese is really good so i usually have that with burgers back in the uk there's a really famous uh restaurant chain called uh, uh gpk gourmet burger chicken gourmet burger kitchen <laughs> i was always thinking about chicken mm. that was good not as good as the first two pieces but definitely a heck of a lot better than that final piece enough of the foreplay i think we should go ahead and get some of that handmade truffle pasta let's get a real mouthful and let's get a little bit of every single thing in that pasta that way we get to taste it exactly how the chef intended me to go ahead and eat it good man uh, so nice and creamy and you can really tell it's handmade and you can really tell it's fresh pasta whatever you get uh, yes pasta that's been cooked or from a packet you can just tell it's like a little bit drier a little bit crispier but not in a good way but this this is honestly incredible nice succulent smooth beautiful texture and look at that it's literally just soaked up and all of that beautiful creamy sauce and of course all of those truffles as well let's give this another try Hello. Oh, guys i am struggling to breathe i've been walking out in the gym for literally the last eight months trying to make a comeback and literally my abs disappeared in one day but i think even though as i'm saying that i think we have room for one more round and this is actually going to be the final round it's just going to be dessert no more food guys i promise you no more food there's no way you can beat this menu it's just so much food can i get one halo halo uh, but you can give me half half only half perfect yeah yeah i am struggling did you see the size of that thing look so usually you get it in that huge glass it's like a I don't know, half a litre or something, but luckily we've got some small ones over here. Oh, look at this, it's bacon over there, nice and fresh. Let's give this a look. Oh, beans? Beans, and this one? Coconut, some green looking beans. Wow. Okay, yeah. yeah, let's try everything. This looks good. Okay, let's do it. Why not? Why not? 
And just over there, it's gonna, I guess, put ice in there as well. And uh, if I remember correctly, they get a little bit of, uh, it's like a condensed milk as well. And then that way you go ahead and mix it. As it melts, you can go ahead and mix it and mix it more and more. There you go, there you see crushed ice in there as well. Ice cream, sir. Okay. I have no idea what I'm saying yes to. <laughs> they just keep saying, you want this? I say yes. <laughs> but I think he's going to put on uh, some ice cream on top of it as well. And look at this as well. So we have the uh, fountains that we saw earlier. Oh my God, this looks so good. Wow. I think this will be the thumbnail. <laughs> Salamat. Enjoy. Salamat. Thank you so much. All right, so let's go ahead and put this on the table. And I guess we'll come back for just one more plate, guys. I'm doing my best. Honestly, this is what? The 10th or 11th plate that we've eaten. Uh, I'm doing my best. <laughs> let's go. Let's go put this back where we started from. Can I get uh, one of this one? Uh, one of this one. Uh, Maybe this one as well. And is it possible to get some of the fountain? This one? Is this the best one? Amazing. Okay. Whoa. Salamat. Salamat. Oh my god, look at this. Look at the uh, crystallized sugar on top of it. You've got the strawberry, You've got the meringue, some sort of jam as well. Oh. All of a sudden, my second stomach just opened. Honestly, I think the good thing about this buffet is so big that you basically work out around, I don't know, 50 calories every time you go up and down. So, yeah, I guess it's not so bad after all. Let's go ahead and put this on the table and let's demolish this. This is really our final round of today. So, of course, we went for the Halo Halo and we went for an assorted mix of dessert. Let me, uh, let me put you guys over here. Let's see. Hopefully you can see me here. And uh, I don't even know where to start. I think the best place to start probably is the Halo Halo. So let's get one spoonful. We literally got all the way down. We won't mix it just yet. But let's get a little bit of everything. And look at this. So you got the beans, the ube, the jelly, the ice cream as well, the ice and the condensed milk. All of this just kind of mixing in together, kind of melting together already without me having to mix it or halo halo. Let's give this a try. Mm. Wow. Honestly, this is as good as I remember having it in the Halo Concello. And obviously, Halo Concello is a legend when it comes to halo halo but honestly this is really really close to it as well this is delicious all right i think this is time now to mix it and this is actually the correct way that you're supposed to have it you're supposed to just mix every single thing you get the beans on top and look at this beans we got um, we got shaved a bit of um, coconut as well Oh, look at this and I have no idea what these are I guess it's some sort of mango or something yeah I think that was dry mango really really nice mixture man let's put that on the side and let's go ahead and let's try some of those desserts as well so we have the some sort of meringue we have a nice charcoal marshmallow on top of it as well nice and squishy and what i like about it is a one biter that way you get to taste quite a few different desserts and you don't don't just go for one then you have to make your choice that way so let's give this a try so nice and squishy and I think that had a little bit of uh, chocolate sauce as well and a little bit of a crunch as well 
And now I think it's a good time to go ahead and try some of that delicious looking sorbet jam. It's like a little bit of a cake. And I think this is mango on top of it, if I can uh, guess correctly. But let's give this a try as well. No, that's not mango. I think it's pear. I think that was pear, pretty sure. It's, uh, yeah, mango has that distinctive flavor. Look, I got mango juice over here. Yeah, that is mango, that wasn't mango. And uh, let's go ahead and get some of this delicious looking custard. Oh my God. Hello. Please be advised the buffet will be closed at 3 p.m. If you want something, you can get it now. I'm Thank finished. You. I'm Enjoy finished. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. I am finished, guys. There's no way I can get some more food. So we've been literally sitting here for two hours eating. Uh, this place actually opens at uh, 12 p.m. So in the afternoon. And right now it is 2.46. So if you didn't believe me before that I was trying my best to be at this buffet, now you know i'm trying my damn hardest <laughs> but anyway let's go ahead and try this uh, custard as well mm, that's good i really really like that the uh the sugar has completely crystallized on top but underneath it you got that creamy custardy eggy sort of taste mm. it's a delicious contrast you buy into it and you can feel the uh, sugar crunching underneath your teeth and that custard is just beautifully swelling around your tongue look at how poetic i'm getting i think it's because i'm half asleep half a coma of food as well <laughs> this is really finally this is the final bite there's no more space and there's no more time as well so let's go ahead and finish off with a beautiful strawberry chocolate covered marshmallows let's finish it off this is what the build came down to so we got a free juice we got the brunch and all together it came down to 4999 pesos guys obviously this is a lot of money this is about i believe a hundred dollars or so and obviously it's not one of those things that you come here every single day you're gonna to have to have this i guess once in a lifetime quite literally because i'll be honest i don't think i could eat for another week or so i am fully stuffed i'm fully satisfied boom so there you go guys that is the end of the video and unfortunately by the looks of it is also the end of my waistline so this is how you put on about five kilos worth of food in probably about five hours or so so which one do I recommend? Honestly, it depends on you, depends on your budget, and it kind of depends on the occasion as well. So if you're in a hurry, maybe it's just your lunchtime and you're trying to get something quick, 100% recommend you go to that Kiapo Market Buffet. It was delicious, fresh, beautiful noodles, beautiful eggs, and the desserts were really good as well. But if it's a special occasion, maybe it's your birthday, maybe it's a graduation, maybe uh, someone is getting married, I also 100% recommend you come to that Spiral Buffet. I mean, you saw the selection, huge, huge selection. We had uh, Italian food, we had uh, French food, we had Indian food, the desserts were really good, the halo halo. My God, I'm getting hungry just thinking about it. But guys, honestly, I'm probably going to disappear for about a week or so. I'm going to go ahead and, uh, I don't know, disappear in a food coma of some sort. Maybe just sit down on the toilet for about a week or so, paying for my sins. You know what the aftermath is like. So hopefully you enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one. Salamat, Paul.